Hi everyone, welcome back. In this lesson, you are going to continue creating our first home screen for the Nike. First thing, we are going to create the search and notification uh, area. So you'll go to the plugins and like always, you are going to use this uh, plugin icon for design and I will search for search. We want a search icon. Obviously, I write it wrong, just like this. And I will choose this icon. You need to select on the artboard so your icon comes there. As you can see, it was far away. So I'll just select the artboard and then I will search for the search icon again. Click on it. This time it should come inside our artboard, which is here. And then you are going to select the artboard again and search for the notification or ring. You can search for the bill. Choose one of the icons. I will choose this one. I may change it later. Now let's put them in the right position and we are going to resize them as well. I'm going to create a rectangle behind them. Let's try circle maybe. No, actually, let's try rectangle. We will make something like this. Make it round and push it behind them. Make it like this. And then I'll go to the layer panel and I will put it behind these two icons. Let's move it over here. I'm just trying to see if it will be nice or not, like both of them in the same background. But obviously I didn't like it actually, I will separate them. So search will have its own background and uh, notification will have its own. We will disable the border for this and I will make it smaller. I will just adjust the size. You follow me and copy the last thing that I go with. So I press on the Alt and duplicated the background for the ring or for the notification. I want to change this ring icon because it doesn't go with the search one. I want something with only with the borders. So something like this one. But I didn't select on the artboard, that's why it was far away. So select the artboard and add it again. Now we have it inside the artboard. And we are going to replace it with this one. Okay, I will select both of them and I will make the size a bit smaller. For this one, I'm going to bring down the border size to two. Move it over here, make this one smaller and I'm going to remove the background for this one and I'm going to copy this one press on the alt and make a copy move it over here and then you're going to change the color for both of them I will make it a uh, gray not dark gray but a bit dark something like this now I'm going to select this with the background and move it to the right side I want to align it with the battery and other stuff Okay, perfect. Now we are good. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do is to create more cards for the shoes. So what I'm going to do is to select on this one, this card, and then we are going to use the repeat grid, which is here. And then I'm going to expand it to the right. I will add three more or two more actually. Total will be three. And then just like this, I'm going to decrease the space between them. Perfect. We are going to do the same for the other one. Click on this one and then repeat grid. We are going to expand it to the right and add two more copies. Like this, we are good. Now all of the cards are the same. I want to change the content. So I'm going to select this one. Then we need to ungroup the grid over here. Now they're all separated and I can change them individually. So I'm going to go ahead, the first one is okay, the second one I'm going to change the show and the name. So we have the collection of the show over here, you can find it over here. I will copy this, Control C, and then I will select this shoe, double click until you are able to select it, and then paste. Now we have this shoe in the same group. I will uh, remove the other one, of course, but let me change the size, remove this one and move it over here 
let's change the name we will make it Air Max Ultra I'm not sure about their name guys this is only for the design purpose so please don't judge me if I write something wrong or anything else like the names if they are not right I'm sorry for that okay now let's uh, change this one we will do the same thing I'll go copy the shoe which will be this one control C and then click on this shoe double click until you're able to select this shoe then paste now we have it here I will remove this one and replace it with this one we are going to adjust the size and the rotation as well it's good like this uh, we need to change the name I'm not sure what was the name okay it was basketball so I will change it to basketball and let's change the price as well okay 180 perfect now we have all of them I'm going to do the same thing for this one okay so select this one or actually before I select I will just copy this one Control C this uh, shoe and then I'm going to paste it in the second one but before we do that I will select this uh, repeat grid because it's a repeat grid everything is connected I'm going to ungroup the grid just like we did for the other one and then select this shoe and paste the one that we just copied so I'll just replace it with this one I will remove this move this in the right place rotate it we are good like this let's change the name for this one what was the name essential wit I'll just copy this name and paste it over here I don't need to write it again for the alignment it will be in the middle and we are going to move it up a bit more okay now let's do the other one okay so I will choose uh, one of the red shoes I will choose this one copy control C and we are going to do it for the other one I'll just make sure what was the name of this shoe yeah, it's a flashback something yeah it's Adidas and flashback I am going to replace it with one of these so this one or the first one actually I'll go with the first one select this shoe and paste it over here the one that we just copied you will change the rotation and the size just like this let me remove this one move this over here okay we are good I think let's change the name to flashback Adidas let's move it in the middle and maybe change the price I'll make it $160 or $65 for this one I'm going to change the price as well perfect now we finished all of the cards that we have uh, the next thing is to change the size of the cards we want the one that are selected bigger than the one that are not selected what I'm going to do is to select both of these and make them smaller so right now they are not in focus only the first one is in focus and is bigger so I'll just move it over here and then I'm going to use the guidelines for them so I'll move one of the lines over here to this one to this side and one from this side just to make it clear I'm using these guidelines for the prototype uh, animation we are going to use these guidelines when you are animating this uh, screen so that's why I'm using these guidelines they are very important so I will remove the sample and rename this one we will make it home Nike okay perfect I'll see you in the next lesson and you're going to create Puma and Adidas degree. I'll see you there. Bye bye.